from what's keeping them in bondage. One time there was this guy on my Facebook, and I was like, dude, just, uh, I can't remember what I said. I said something to help him, for because he was like, always complaining about being depressed, being depressed. I just told him like, yeah, just cast the devil out of your atmosphere. You have authority over these devils or something like that. And he, and he like went to his wall. Like I just feel some yuck on him and, uh, like just praise God, dude. And he's like, oh, this guy's so mean to me. He doesn't understand. I need my medication. I need this. I'm like, take your medication and rebuke the devil, you know? I never said to not take your medication. I just said, cast the devil out of your atmosphere. And he just like went off, like like I was the like I was Satan himself trying to to hurt him. All I said is just cast the devil out of your atmosphere. That's exactly what a spirit of depression is. It's a spirit of heaviness. Put on the government's praise for the spirit of heaviness. Spirit of above, depression. Above you. Above you. Huh. Yeah, we need to list our vision higher. Get it off of ourself in this world and put it on the Prince of Peace. <laughs> All right. Shabba. I feel confirmation on that right there. <laughs> All right, we are on the road again. We're going to grab some arrows. Look at those teeth. Ah. Uh, uh. Um, we need spears. Actually, you know what? This is useless in this stage. Oh, Jesus, Shaka. Thank you for opening our eyes wider to see Jesus. Uh oh. Come at me, bro. We can't see Jesus, we'll only see ourselves. Have a pity party and invite everyone there. Those those pity parties are not fun. <laughs> you call that a party? <clears throat> Self pity is Satan's strongest manifestation. He'll always. Well, uh, he's depressed because he got kicked out of heaven. And you get to you get to kick him while he's down. You'll never be up ever again. You get to crush his head with Jesus' foot. That's right, we're the foot of we're the foot of Jesus, right? Part of the body of Christ. Well, part of that foot, uh, the responsibility and the privilege is to crush Satan. Remember, he shall bruise your heel, but it was written in the prophecy in the book of Genesis. He shall crush his head, but he's going to bruise your heel. So even the lowest in the body of Christ can crush Satan's head. With Jesus' foot. <laughs> oh man, that's good news. You don't need a PhD, an ABC, or any kind of alphabet. You just gotta, you just gotta be in Jesus. That's it. One word. And you, you'll meet all these religious people. It's not Jesus. It's Yeshua Hamashiach. And if you don't say Yeshua Hamashiach, he's not gonna listen to you. Well, no. I got born again saying Jesus. <laughs> My English Bible says Jesus. And. Uh, the devils obey the name of Jesus, so it's working for me. God looks at our heart, not our theology. Whoa. And he'll correct the theology as long as we have a correct heart. And that heart is simple as this, burning with Jesus. Or how about burning with Yeshua HaMashiach. 
I don't even know if that's how you say it. Some people say it's Jehovah. Some people say it's Yahweh. You know, I don't know. I call upon whoever calls upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Lord, save me. <laughs> and you're just like, Jesus, you know, I don't know. It takes a theologian to confuse the child of God and talk them out of salvation. That's the truth. Now let's beware lest anyone be bewitches you out of the simplicity of the gospel. Which is what is that? The simplicity. It's Christ. Uh actually we'll do it this way. Whoa, that guy can jump. Christ in you, hope of glory. Period. Explanation mark. We'll go with that. We got a hearty truffle. We'll use it in a shuffle. Yeah. Jesus didn't come to start a religion. Jesus didn't come so we could be slaves of, of anything except for his love and his peace. <laughs> How do you know you're a true slave? You're going to be getting whacked in his love and his peace, man. I'm starting to think this is a better bow. Oh, come on, man. Wow, one head shot. Oh, this game is so relaxing. Killing these lizards. You know, Satan is a lizard. I think he was a cherubim or a seraphim, but he's fallen. 